Welcome back. We're still getting our groove, groove on. on. <laughs> okay, now let's join the Owunali family to celebrate their father, Nze Charles Owunali, who marked his birthday in his own special way. Enjoy. Fun gathering. Decent crowd made up of close families, friends and well-wishers. A perfect definition of a modest way to celebrate one's special day. This was how businessman and former chairman of Abom Bisei local government area of Imo State, Nze Charles Omonali, chose to mark his day. He stepped in happily, exchanging pleasantries with friends who have in a short notice turned out for this dinner to mark this day with him. The occasion kicked off with a short prayer. Nse Omunali, who is indeed happy to be alive to witness another year in his life, wouldn't have let this day just go by without marking it. And all he wanted was just to have all these people close to him and his family come around to eat, drink and generally have a wonderful evening. And then dinner was served with varieties of sumptuous meals to choose from. Celebrant led every other guest to make their choice. The perfect hostess, his wife of 25 years, Frances Omonali was on hand making sure everyone was comfortable. For the celebrant, celebrating this birthday is just a way to thank God for all the challenges he has been through, singling out the incidents of his kidnap years ago. Sometime five years ago, I was kidnapped and I, I was in kidnap uh, then for 25 days and I tell you I never knew there was still life after that experience um, I got dispirited uh, things uh, I was demoralized I never knew but today I'm back to life again and uh, very willing to live all these my friends and God I cannot thank him enough for the uh, spectacular grace he's shown to me. His family are indeed happy that their father is alive to celebrate this day in good health and sound mind. I just want to thank you all for honoring us. Even though at very short notice, the, the crowd that I'm seeing here, and, and I'm highly honored. And I thank you for coming to spend the time with us. He has been my husband for 25 years. You are due for long service award. Yes. A lot of you were here on that day. She's due for an assistant. Oh, Baroon. Thank you. 
was always like, he never allows us to fail. He's always making sure that we do our things right. And most importantly, he makes us learn how to do things on our own. That's why he advises us. To further mark the day, the celebrant stepped up to his kickstand together with his family to cut his cake. And that was followed by a toast conducted by his friend, Mr. Stanley Amuchi, to long life, prosperity and greater achievements. I will thank God for uh, making it to see this day. To be 55, I will thank God for everything. And it's that is why we all have to toast to a lot of things. One, we want to toast to good health for him. We want to toast for long life for him. We want to toast for every good thing. In his business and everything, he puts his hands into pray that everything will work out well for him. I can professionally attest to his character. He's a very good man, a hard-working person, and he has contributed a lot to the growth and development of this country. And that is why you see the turnout this evening is the testimony to his character and his good relationship with people. Well, I wish him all the best. Charles is a, is a hands full, so I know he will continue to do business. I know he will continue to do his financial engineering. He's an FX guru and he's, a, he's, a, he's good in finance. He's also very good in, he's also very good in, um, in, in, in philanthropy. Oh, Charles. Charlie, as I call him, you know, he's, he's just awesome. He's, um, he's, he's trying to, you know, explain the type of person Charlie is. It will take you the whole day. He's just, is a very good, nice, humorous human being. He's a complete gentleman. Nze Charles Omunali, who has been described by many as a family man and dedicated to the growth and development of his community, was born on 16th of January 1961. He had his education at Ife Grammar School, as in Nihite Mbise Imo State, Federal School of Arts and Science, Victoria Island between 1980 to 1981, and University of Lagos, where he backed BSc in Economics and Masters in Finance and Accounting from the same university. He has worked in different reputable organizations where he made a mark, especially in banking, before delving into politics and became the executive chairman at Bombisei local government area Imo State between 2010 and 2011. Nze Omunali, who holds one of the highest traditional titles in his community, is currently chairman CEO Paradigm Adjustment Consulting Group. He is married to Frances and they are blessed with two lovely children. Here is wishing him many more fruitful years ahead. Wow, I mean, right crowd, you know, everyone getting comfortable Indeed. with each other because I mean, they all know themselves. So. Yes, and it looks like it was so much fun when you're around people you love you know, uh, you and know, you want to really. celebrate people with people you know and you love. And it's on that very beautiful note to wrap it up on Metrofile today. But remember, you can continue this and that's on our website, that's channelstv.com. View as many times as you want. You no, can also follow us on Twitter. Make sure you do that. Those handles are right on your screen. Let's keep the thank conversation you so much. going on. Yes, thank <laughs> you so much for being a part of the show. It always means a lot to us, you know. I'm Anne Owawodo. And I'm Ogechukosi. Thank you so much and have a lovely weekend. Bye.